Uh, we build high resolution digital elevation models for tsunami modeling. We try to gather any type of elevation data that we can. That includes bathymetric data and topographic data. Topographic data is data, elevation data of land, and bathymetric data is the elevation data uh, for underneath the ocean surface. And because we can't see that because of the ocean and the water, uh, we have to use other techniques to gather that elevation, or what we call bathymetry, such as sonar from ships. So this image here, the darker blue is going to represent the deeper colors or the deeper part of the ocean. And so you can see as the blues become lighter up, we're going shallower um, towards the, the coastline. And then as we hit the coastline, we switch colors to the greens and browns to represent the different elevations along the, the coast. The Crescent City DEM is interesting because there's unique harbor dynamics for Crescent City. So historical tsunamis have been worse in Crescent City than nearby areas, partially because the wave has been funneled with offshore topography, but also because when the wave gets into the harbor of Crescent City, it kind of resonates off of the breakwaters and just historically it's caused higher inundation and waves in that region. For the March 11th tsunami, uh, it was great to actually have this DEM that was already produced and used for tsunami hazard and preparedness because the tsunami was um, propagated across the whole Pacific Basin. And by having this DEM in an advance, we were able to use it in our model to predict the high waterline or how far this wave's going to inundate into the land so that we can give out evacuations. Um, so we know what areas need to be evacuated and not evacuated. So Crescent City, it's kind of got a bullseye mark on it because so it's located 4,500 miles away from where the actual tsunami happened. But because of the Mendocino Fracture Ridge, it funneled that tsunami wave energy straight towards Crescent City. And on top of that, because of the dynamics of the harbor, uh, the wave resonated and they had like eight feet of inundation uh, from that wave way across from the Pacific Ocean.